Well, it seems to me to be essential. Um, social action is embedded in, in a society. Uh, you know, I don't want to argue here about how we distinguish culture and society. They're, they are certainly related. They, they are studied you know, by different specialties in different ways. But it's the embeddedness of language use deep within a context that, that involves assumptions, values, interests, presuppositions, the prior genres, uh, complete histories and traditions that we need to understand in order to understand how a genre is, is a mode of action, is a way of, of uh, getting things done, in a, in, in, uh, even of understanding what things can be done and should be done and how they are going to be interpreted in that society. Um, so I would I would just um, summarize by saying that that uh, culture is a sort of central um, containing uh, consideration in understanding genre and social action. I guess I have to start up asking what definition of culture or what is culture, yeah. and that is highly contested. Uh, in, in many areas in anthropology certainly that's uh, one of the uh, enduring uh, topics of discussion um, I'll give a couple of uh, possible uh, definitions or uh, elements of culture and talk about how they uh, would enter in so uh, 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 cultural historical psychology says uh, that uh, culture is in uh, the tools and artifacts that are uh, made available in a society for a person to use. Um, and one can certainly see that the uh, uh, media of communication and the genres um, as well as other elements of language are uh, historically available, historically evolving and available tools uh, around which one, uh, through which one can uh, carry out social interaction. Um, so from that, it, uh, the genre uh, actually uh, is culture from that point of view. Mm -hmm. um, uh, some, some people extend that to include the practices, which may mean the uh, uh, the particular ways people handle and orient towards the tools, other people's behaviors. Um, and again, um, a genre can be seen, especially when you start looking at it from a kind of a psychological view, as creating a, a kind of disposition or an orientation uh, towards events, uh, sets of reactions, sets of evaluations, um, so in that sense, a genre can also be seen um, well intertwined with, with culture and in fact a, a means of carrying out cultured behavior um, in the sense of habitus. And so that's also something that people use to talk about as culture.